Previously on Dark Dreams Don't Die. <laughs> oh, here it goes again. Drugs are bad, okay? Jesus. Uh, I really don't want to push you, so let's just talk, yeah? What are you doing here? <laughs> this big fella. I've met him before somewhere. I can't remember where. My scar is desperately trying to tell me that he knows something. I don't know this man. Already, how long you planning on keeping me waiting? The hell is going on? Get out here now! Fuck! See it! See it! Fucking with my big eye, weren't you? Trying to take it while I was sleeping? Is that your ass or your head? No more messing with this puppy! Uh, 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 uh. More lightning? Bad! Real bad! Bolt! I said! You're never, ever, ever gonna get my face, guy! Did not! Bitch. Antonio Zapatero! <laughs> there you are! You're this young I've been hearing so much about. Not like I'm gonna spill the slop on thee, though. What do you need from me? Hey, Papi! <laughs> Don't so you call me Papi. You die, <laughs> Bring it on, then. Damn it! Wait! And all you got? There's no way to oh. there. there. If you wanna know about me, come on. Go on that fucking investigation. Let's dance. There you go. Whatever it is. I need it. Are you serious? You can be so easy there. Then I'll just have to take it. By force! I don't think so. If you really do know who he is, I'll Jesus. What? If I really know, you'll what? Young a ling a ding dong. Oh my god, this so good. Oh no. Oh. Yeah, things just got serious. <sighs> All right. All right. Let's fucking Zapatero. do this then. I'm knocking this one out of the park. Let's do this. No hitting back at the picture. This is how you use a megaphone. What is the evidence you have? Tell me! Spill it! You fucking dumbass! Baby! Is that all you got? What do you know about D? Tell me! That really hurts! I don't care. Oh shit. I'm going to kill you! Come on! There we go. Hand over! Hand over! Wait, what? Oh! Ooh! You give up! You've had enough! Right? 
I'd say the same to you. Come on, man. Oh, shit! Whoa! Whoa, fuck! Nighty night, yummy. Soda. All right, buddy, get off me. Come on. Here, you can take this. Here, take some more. Now I've got you. Can't vanish now, can you? Don't move. What? Let him go. Olivia? Well, you want to shoot that in here. I warned you. We don't take kindly to stowaways. What the hell? Just... Who are you? I... <laughs> You gotta be kidding me. That creepy guy's still back there. He... vanished? Alright, buddy, you and I gotta talk. Marshal, are you okay? What's with the attitude? I'm only asking because I was worried. You'd think nothing happened at all. I don't need your jabber, boy. <laughs> Derek Buchanan. I'm not sure why, but he seems determined to ignore me. Uh... You know what, let's... I guess I'll ask about your wife, because I just already did roast you about your head once, or whatever. You've got quite a young wife. Is there a big age gap between you? You're giving courage to men all across our fair nation. If a stony-faced gorilla like you can marry such a young, beautiful creature, there's hope for all of us yet, isn't there? But that's a surprise. You're the last person I'd expect to be carrying a picture of your family. I gotta go oh, easy, man. Up. I don't know who you are. But if you want to keep sucking down air, never talk to me again. Man, not the drip. What the hell? A man is far more than just his looks. My wife understood that well. Marshal Buchanan doesn't know who I am? There's something very odd going on here. But just what is it? Man, I ain't got a clue to push. What's wrong with you? Hell yeah. Woohoo! Go, Boston, go! <laughs> Nothing says Boston quite like this. There must be a baseball fan on board. It's for Boston versus New York. Pretty good seats, too. Of course, it's been used. Things don't come that easy. Hmm. 
Why would you do that? Military. Probably not. Push. Sorry. Oh, ma chérie. I know. You must have been so scared. How is my Suki? Okay. There'll be champagne as soon as we arrive in D.C. Ooh, I think some Chardonnay might be nice. Didn't your mannequin just break? Hey! Excuse me! She's Suki, not a mannequin! Therefore, she most certainly cannot ever just break. Do you intend to make an enemy of the entire fashion industry? No. That mannequin got totally wrecked. Tut tut! Say another word, mister, and I shall unleash my anger! Okay, you win. Forget I even asked about it. Uh, my bad. No more about Suki. That's right. She's not a mannequin. We can forget this ever happened. Of course, us being top fashion designers, we're never going to remember you anyway. <laughs> Shimmy, 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 my hands and feet are cramping up. What are you doing that for? You there. Perfect timing. I can't take it anymore. Take what? What is Deborah talking about? That lightning strike electrified the floor and handrails. So I'm doing my best not to touch them. You see, I'm still alive. But you know you I can just touch it. I can't take it anymore. My arms, legs, neck. Back, everything is screaming in pain. <laughs> right. I need to try and calm it down. <sighs> Man, you are really paranoid, huh? It's not electrified. You're fine. Sheesh. Lightning striking an airplane. Here we Crazy. go. Huh. Alright, let's talk to you. Cause you're kinda creeping when did me you out. Move to this seat? Mr. Young. So funny, you would ask. What does that mean? If time changes, so too does place. Time is of the essence. You of all people should understand. Right. I really hope you don't keep talking like that, dude, because if so, I'm sorry. If you kept talking extremely slow for eight minutes straight. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. I didn't want to put you guys through that. Control will be an issue if I can't find it. Hey there, how you doing? Sir, can I help you with anything? Where's Olivia? Excuse me, yeah. sir. Exactly which Miss Olivia are you searching for? Olivia Jones. She's a member of the crew, just like you are. I'm very sorry, sir, but she isn't aboard this flight. Come on. Did that lightning strike you too? She was right here a moment ago. In any case, you need to contact Logan Airport immediately. Tell them we have an emergency up here. Also, 
Get the BPD to send some cops to the airport. Detective Forrest Kazan in particular. Give him my name and you'll have no problems. Well, excuse me, sir. Are you hoping to use this confusion for something nefarious? What? If so, I'll have to stop you. Ugh, damn Next it. time, I'll break more than you watch. Oh boy, here we go again. Yeah. My most humble apologies. Hey, yo, I'll make the, the call about the suspicious person immediately. To our destination. Ronald Reagan International Airport. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to get back to work. Still a weird game, but hey, all right, whatever. Wipe, 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 wipe. What a beautiful sunset. It reminds me of the day I proposed. Oh. <laughs> Little Peggy. I'll find who killed you. I will. I've collected all the puzzle pieces. The west side, west side window. Be champagne as soon as we arrive in DC. I'm very sorry, sir. But you isn't a boy. I don't know who you are. That's it. This piece of the past has been solved. Marshall, are you really sentimental enough to hold on to a pen that can't even write? Unexpected. Most unexpected. You seem quite different from the man I first imagined you to be. But that doesn't mean you're totally free from suspicion. I told you The same uh, trick won't God work twice. Damn it. Although it's still the first uh, time for you. Oh, thanks for that. Two of the same the pen. The Fenway Park ticket was a used ticket. What? The seat cover pattern is cherry blossom and snow. What are you rambling about? The destination is in the other direction. The sun can be seen from the windows on the right side. In other words, the aircraft is flying south. Explain yourself clearly. I am David Young, a private detective who also collaborates with the BPD. Now you, Derek Buchanan, I consider you suspicious. If you are the one I'm after, you're gonna remain heavily involved in my investigation from now on. So let me give you this warning. I'll do whatever it takes to achieve my goal. I'll never give up. Even if it means I have to get in your way. So be ready for that. Oh, one other thing. Something I probably ought to mention. According to the BPD files, you get killed while transporting the courier known as Rabbit. Guess that's the last time I'm seeing you then, buddy. Sorry, buddy. Antonio Zapatero and Olivia Jones. They vanished right in front of my eyes. Literally, vanished. They didn't vanish at all. They were never on this flight. This isn't the AG Flight 117 of Boston. It's a different aircraft heading for Washington. In other words, they didn't vanish. I moved. It must have happened at that moment. I used the broken fountain pen to come further back in time. Mm. Not 
not a memento anymore. Can't die. Don't feel anything from either one anymore. David. Why do you shave your beard every day? <laughs> it was just starting to grow out. Such a waste. Little Peggy. What should I do? All right, buddy, that, that was not necessary. Marshall, huh? Damn it. 